Last time on Detroit Become Human. What kind of shit is in this pool? What is this? Man's got a fucking Kool-Aid pool. This man's rich as fuck. I want to go in the Kool-Aid pool. Let me go in. Look at that shit. Alrighty. Hello everyone. My name's Soundproof and welcome back to another episode of our Detroit Become Human Let's Play. So last episode... A lot went down. I'm just saying, a lot went down. Like, holy crap. I found, I was looking back at the video, I found like a point before Kara's mission where I probably should have ended it, but because I didn't, that episode went on for quite a bit longer than it probably should have. But at least you didn't, at least I didn't leave you on like the big cliffhanger of we got to see all, you know, that all the, all the different stories collided at once. At, the, at that last mission from last episode so yeah last episode there was that one riot that we did with marcus where we made it peaceful we broke into the we broke into the store and got the androids out and we had a peaceful riot and then as connor we investigated the the i think it was like the one of the guys who helped found cyberlife who had quit cyberlife we investigated him as connor and we had that whole like Oh, are you going to shoot this android or not thing? Had that going on. And then we had the scene with Norf and Marcus where they kind of like had a, I guess, heart to heart. And so that way they could be closer to each other with their cause. And then we had the second riot where we were just grabbing a whole bunch of androids f from off the streets. And we were just protesting peacefully, which ended up horribly because they ended up getting shot anyways. Then we went back to the, the police department place as Connor and Hank, and they had kicked this off the case finally because the FBI decided to take over. But Connor was like, hey, look, I'll go get some evidence and try to help out with this. And yep, that's what happened. Got pretty crazy there. So then after, okay, yeah, that was, that ended with us getting the location for Jericho. And then... Because we could have gotten Jericho's location, I think, in a couple ways, but yeah. And then the next mission was the one where it was the Crossroads mission, but it started off with Kara getting to Jericho. And then, obviously, you had Connor get there undercover, and Marcus was there, of course, because they're talking plans of the future. That was, that, that was, that was crazy. There was the whole raid going on. And, unfortunately, Connor died, and... Uh, Luther died as well in it, which it seemed like it was it was gonna be pretty hard to make decisions honestly in that. Oh yeah, hopefully we get we're gonna get back into this. I don't know whose storyline we're gonna get into after all that shenanigans happen, but let's do it. Wait, are you sure you should continue? Maybe. Maybe we should leave things as they are. Oh, interesting. Are you sure you should continue? Yes. As you wish. I want to see the story, damn it. Yeah, okay. That's pretty interesting. I, I kind of like that whole menu thing where it's kind of like it changes. Okay, cool. Hopefully this runs fine because... There was a Windows update, and it kind of messed with Steam stuff, and I had to like reinstall shaders for this game again. For this, yeah, for this game again. At least it didn't take as long as last time. Home, oh, it actually still recognizes us. Yeah, might as well ask, how's your guys' day been? Because I'm actually technically recording this really late because I tried to get recordings earlier for Smite, but and that was like, like I'm recording this at like three in the morning. <laughs> and I, like before, like yesterday, I was trying to get recordings for Smite, but I just couldn't get anything. So now I'm just like, I'm up and I'm like, okay, you know, I'm going to record this early so that way I can get this video out and the Smite video also, just to compensate because I really should have had a slight video out, but I just couldn't get a good gameplay. But, 
Enough of that. Hi, Dad. I'm getting out of the hospital tomorrow. They told me that you stayed with me while I was asleep. I am... Uh, I'm really sorry about everything that happened. I'm gonna stop all that shit. Uh, it messes me up. It, it, it turns me into somebody I hate. Hey, I, I'd like to come by and, and, and see you tomorrow. Ooh, that's pretty interesting. So he didn't end up dying. Okay. Yeah, I was wondering. I'm like, did he die from that? So there's our answer. Right there. Oh, wait, I don't know why I'm looking at all this stuff. Hopefully our boy's fine. I mean, obviously he should be fine because he went to the hospital to see his son. Maybe he's still a little bit distraught about um, us, of course. Because obviously we we ended up getting shot w when we were last here. Check out the kitchen. I don't know if his son is going to be, like, you know, exactly thrilled to see us or not. Since, you know, we can't, we were the ones that pushed them, of course. Well, who knows, maybe he had a change of heart. I mean, it seems like he had somewhat of a change of heart, but maybe that's just towards his dad. And him realizing, oh, I fucked up. Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to... Oh, he's a new android. Oh, interesting. I'm... Hmm. Oh. Please. I need to see him. Okay. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. Ooh, that's not good. Huh. Okay, he, I mean, he was pretty ill, it seems like. Oh shit, he's like on his fucking deathbed. Carl. <gasps> Marcus. I was hoping you'd come. I missed you so much, girl. You don't know how much I've missed you. What's wrong, Marcus? I don't know what to do anymore. All I have left are bad options. And no matter what I decide, there's going to be blood. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for it to end. Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I should have went with decision. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but... Tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. Yeah. You have to accept the world as it is. Or fight to change it. Oh, damn. Yep. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls in the darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss, but don't let it consume you. Oof. 
pretty tense. Gotta make the hard decisions in life, and sometimes they're not easy to accept. Stop their instability. I still don't know what that how that's gonna affect us in like the end game. The previous Connor failed its mission. You're going to replace it. You know what you have to do, don't you? Destroy the leader of the deviants. Go, Connor. Don't disappoint me. We still haven't figured out who she is. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, cool. We're, we're back to where we were. I don't know why it does that. Like, it was like, what, the second or third crash I've had with this game? Like, I lowered my settings, but I don't know. Maybe it just happens sometimes. Holy crap. Oh, all the people of Jericho get moved. Yeah, because of the raid. Hmm. I'm guessing we're going to have a speech to all of them. Talk to your people. Yeah, this is pretty tough. Oh, I, th I thought we were going to, like, stand up right there. Um, uh, situation. They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps. For extermination. Hmm. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Oh, okay. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm okay. Oh yeah, she had gotten shot at one point. Hit me by components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. To be fair, she is one of the people. In a few hours it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world or the world will have destroyed us. Oh damn. You have to make a choice, Marcus. Whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Oh, damn, we got the relationship. In. We got the romance in the with North. Yeah, that was a big part in the last episode was getting that romance option. The question is, is this happening in other cities too? Oh, damn. Well, I mean, we already had the lover status, but this has gone up even more. Oh, okay, we gotta talk to our other boy. Who we also, I think we had to save him at one point too. see our people free one day you and I haven't always agreed but I know we're fighting for the same thing whatever you decide I'm with you Marcus yep, gotta make the tough choices here especially with people dying okay I'm guessing now this is our speech Inform your people of your choice. Okay, we're gonna go up here. The game looks fine. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Ooh, 
this is big. March peacefully towards the camp to pressure the authorities, launch an assault on the camps that liberate the androids. Huh. Okay, and our public opinion is supportive. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to keep going with the route I've been going the entire game. Might as well. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them peacefully that we want justice. Ah, fucking hell. If there's hell. any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? Nope. It's not the decision for everyone, but it's still a decision. Okay, cool. Knights of the Soul. Knight of the Soul. Oh, okay. We haven't even gotten through through his part. Yeah, looks like that keeps going. Okay. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Madam President! Madam President! Is it true that a large number Ooh. of deviants are still on the loose? We don't have the full reports at this time, but if so... This is pretty I interesting. We haven't gotten to see... We haven't gotten to see the President yet. Madam President! That much. Um, deviant. Please. Has the leader of the deviants been apprehended? The deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Madam President! Madam Ma President! Madam President! Please? Uh, Over here, please? Public opinion. Madam President! Public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Ooh. Public opinion is one thing, the security of the state is another. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American people. Madam President! Madam President! Madam President! Madam President! Madam President. Madam Pre is it true that androids make up 60% of the armed forces? Is our army still able to ensure our homeland security? Oh. We neutralized all military androids the second their reliability came into doubt. We have called the National Guard for reinforcement. Our armed forces are fully operational and are able to ensure our homeland security. Thank you. That will be all. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Uh, you really had to choose your questions there. Holy crap. Oh, where are we now? Where are they taking us? Oh, did we get captured? I don't know, Alice. Oh fuck. Come on, get out! Get a move on! Out! Well. No, I don't want Alice to be stressed. God damn it. Hands on your heads. Well, as I do as we said. Line up with the others right now. 
Okay. Okay, cool. Recycling area, that doesn't sound good. Brought it down a little bit. You first. Wait, persuade soldier. Persuade soldier. It's all right. She'll go now. Won't you, Alice? Oh, okay. I wasn't. I, I thought it was. I thought it was gonna be persuade soldier for us to go for. It was like a like a. Uh, what is that one series? I can't remember. Come Hunger on. Games it's kind of story. Going. Like we go first. I thought it was gonna be like that where we go first. This is getting some pretty fucked shit. Game still looks pretty good, even at the settings I set it to. This game is pretty intense, though. Wait, is that an insider? Deactivate your skin. Hurry up. Have we ever seen? We've never. We have to. Wait, is, is that the hair too? Oh, that's fucking weird. Even the hair. What the Trip fuck? Off. Put your clothes in the dumpster. Oh fuck, this is gonna... Is this safe for YouTube? I don't know if I can show this on YouTube. Okay, I think, I think I'll be fine. Uh, I guess they're gonna. Come on, this way. Get a move on. Come on, this way. Come on, lady. I gotta go. I gotta go. Get me some PF Changs after this. I gotta. Oh fuck. You take this one of a dump. No, no, please, I beg. I'll do it. Don't leave me. I'll be right back. Oh fuck. No, why? I didn't want to stress her out more. I just didn't want I just didn't want things to be worse in the camp. Damn. Just a over there. Move it. Just a one in one in the brain. This probably plays out differently depending on what you do, of course. Couldn't we have Alice come with us? Okay, time to go back to our child. My child! Oh, maybe we actually see what's happening. Holy crap, that is not good. Hey, what's going on over here? Hold on. I don't want to get shot. If I get shot, I swear to God, I'm going to be fucking restarting immediately. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what that option would give, give me anyways. Coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. 
The leader of the deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Ooh, okay. Finally making a stand. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. It's going down, boy. It's going down. 10:56 p.m. Oh, we're going. We're headed towards the camp. Oh my god, dude, this is a big standoff. Holy crap! Wait, wait, oh. Okay, this is being a little weird. That's why you might see Marcus moving a little weird. W and D, W and D. That's all I gotta do. W and D. Okay, you can see the group behind us. Thousands? How do you count this as thousands? Are you fucking blind, my dude? Holy shit. Unless there's like a lot more behind us, but that would be quite a stretch. Here we are. The moment of truth. Can we actually stop or convince the humans? I mean, it's not like we have gun or guns or anything. All the fucking reporters are like, we gotta get scoops on this shit. We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now. What the hell? Oh, we're being surrounded. Okay, we might. There's no turning back now. Um, firm, calm, or accuse. Hmm. We'll go with. I don't want to accuse them because that's gonna really piss them off. We'll go with calm. We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort to violence. But we are not leaving until our people are free. Well, I mean, to be fair, they could just keep going and we could stand here. Uh, wait. Oh, whoops. My bad. I didn't, I didn't realize. I didn't realize we were still moving. I was like, wait, what? Oh, fuck. Raise hands, raise fist, knee, or... Sit. Let's sit down. I don't know if that changes much. Are you going to open fire on unarmed protesters? Wait, was one of the guards down? Hold on. Did I see that right? Or... Hmm. Oh. Yeah, this is not going to look good for the fucking press. Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Oh, they did a ceasefire. Okay, now we're back to Connor. Ooh. Where is Connor going to be? Now that Con this is a different Connor... Or what is he gonna do? Is he gonna have different thinking now compared to the one that we knew? Also, I, I'm not sure where to end this episode because I don't want it to end on a huge cliffhanger, of course. Or maybe I should for the contents. Be like, all right, cliffhanger, gotta watch the next episode. This game isn't that long. Like, we're, you can tell we're like almost done with this game.
Oh, damn. We're busting out the snipper riffle. Got ourselves a bipood. Oh, wait, is the, do we make the choice? Hank's going to be like, no. Shouldn't do this, Connor. Yep. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. You're going to kill a man who wants to be free. That is my business. Oh, no, please. I do not want to. It's not a man. It's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. They're alive. Deviants are a threat to humans, Hank. They're the reason this country's on a brink of civil war. They have to be stopped. We're in this mess because we refuse to listen to deviants. Humanity never learns from its mistakes, Connor. Ah, oh, fuck. I thought reasonable was going to be like, oh, you know, I can reason with him. This time it could be different. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. I want to be on Hank's side. Step away from the ledge. Oh, fuck. Hank's son. Oh, that's a pretty big one. To be like, oh, your son was killed by... Androids, maybe. After all we've been through, I respected you, Hank. I thought we were friends. Oh, uh, yeah, I was just starting to like you, too. But then I realized you never change. You don't feel emotions, Connie. You fake them. You pretended to be my friend when you don't even know the meaning of the word. Um. What are you gonna do, Hank? You gonna shoot me? I thought android lives mattered to you. Get away from the fucking ledge. You know I'll shoot you if I have to. <laughs> He's like, you're the second one. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I always have to think in these fucking, in these fucking action scenes, I always gotta concentrate. I don't know who we're, it, it's it like we're controlling both of them technically. Oh fuck, that, that's not gonna feel good. Oh, I don't want to kill Hank, please. I guess he's just completely like 188. I wanted to make it to where Connor's kind of back on our friendly side. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay. Is Connor. Is Hank dead because of that? Oh, fuck. That was the weapon damage. What? Alice? Get out of here. I was with a little girl. 
Wait, can I? I kind of want to go back to that. Can we go to... Right, the enclosure. Oh my god, there's a lot more you could fucking do. Holy shit, that's quite a bit. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna check up on this. I know what happened to your son, Hank. It wasn't your fault. The truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Little Cole had just turned six. Shut up! Don't you talk about my son! He needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it, so an android had to take care of him. Poor Cole didn't make it. An android killed your son, Hank, and now you want to save them? No. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. All this time I blamed androids for what happened, but it was the human's fault. Him and this fucked up world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Oh, okay. Um Killing you is not part of my mission. Uh is this still going to go out the same? I think it is. I'm glad to have met you, Hank. I'm glad I'm not at least going to show this off. Oh wow, he just straight up leaves, okay. So yeah, I had a... Obviously I'm cutting to this, cause holy crap, that was... This is way different than what happened. Huh. Alice? Get out of here. Okay. I was with a little girl. Wait, we're together, she needs me. Ah! Oh shit, okay. Oh, you think? Oh, because he didn't want to do the thing. What's behind these doors? Talk. Jerry? Jerry. Clara. So they captured you too. They came to take out the Jerry's. They separated us. Oh, those Jerry's. Okay. But it's all going to work out, isn't it? Uh, no. No, it isn't. We're going to get... Do you know where Alice is? Alice. The little one? No, y yes. We think we saw her. Oh shit, a second Jerry. Jerry! Carl. Jerry number two. If we can help in any way, just ask. We have to save the little one. Of course. What's behind these doors? Why does he keep saying that? Jerry? Jerry number 3500. Stay here. We come back soon. Cara, Alice, are you okay? Are you hurt? I don't like this place. We have to get out of here. Come on, move along. Ah, crap. That's not come good. On, you no, too. Wait a minute. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Cara, Alice. Uh oh. Not good. Not good. Not good. Join Alice. What's behind these doors? Uh, how do we get over there? Oh, okay. Do 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 do. Oh shit! What's up, fellas? Come on this way. Get moving. Faster. Oh. Oh, thanks. Okay, I'm really glad that I changed my decision with the Hank thing, because holy crap, I don't want Hank to die, that's our boy. What the hell, we're like setting up base, <laughs> we're setting up like a little operations over here.
Huh, I wonder how... Th oh, we got shot, too, at some point. Well, I mean, well, obviously when they fired at us. But we didn't go down. Even though it probably fucking hurts. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Where's the... Is that a car? Oh, oh okay. Hey, help me! Push! Push! If anybody gets that reference, you're a fucking legend. Uh, did we just randomly grab a fucking street sign? I know it was not an easy decision to make. Yeah, you know, I've been shot like a few times at hearts. Support your people, of course. Many of our people have fallen. The humans have no pity for those who are different. Yeah, I'm gonna try and help out everybody. Um, where is... Oh, it's over here. Yeah, you know, just a little bit of trauma. Any of us were killed. It could have been me. I'm scared. I, I don't want to shut down. Of course. We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. Got to be a motivational speaker. Someone. Okay, what is this? Just oh fuck, magazine. Yes, let's go. I actually didn't read the magazines that I got from last episode. Oh what? Oh, I wonder if that's because of the. Is that gonna just stay like that? Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna look at that for long. I do not want to give anybody a fucking seizure. I don't know what's going to be a good stopping point for this episode. Especially with the the cut I'm going to have to make. The couple of cuts I'm going to have to make. Marcus, we found what you asked for. There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. Live. Yeah. Ooh, a fancy gun. Okay. I think I I I would have went with a different one, but I guess I wasn't like I guess I didn't fully understand what that meant, or I guess how the message was gonna be shown. But that's alright. I think. Any message would have been good. I should have probably went with the equality one. I think that would have been my option. Okay, there's the north. It's all home for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. I lost all contact with the people at the camps. I can't hear their voices anymore. 
Maybe the humans have scrambled our network. Yeah, I guess they could have. Maybe they just can't get through. Bum, bum. Gret's desperate doubts. There's no other way out. They are going to kill us. The only hope we have left is that we don't die for nothing. You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. Well, I mean, we haven't died yet, so... No matter what happens now, we're making history. Yeah, there's quite a bit to do in this area, honestly. I am glad that this isn't a super exploration game, because holy crap, I'd be like... I wouldn't be... Obviously, I wouldn't 100% the game, but I'd definitely be wanting to check out a bunch of different things. Oh, wait, this thing is the last thing. Tink. Damn, that was loud. Oh shit. Oh, it's the FBI dude. Marcus? Come to talk to you, Marcus. Hmm. Come on. You have my word. I won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. Yeah. They want to get you out in the open. Sure. Don't go, Marcus. Do we have a choice in the matter? Come on, Mark. We can talk from right here. I have nothing else to say. Free our people, then we'll talk. I came here to negotiate. Isn't that what you want? Um, no. I gave you my answer. Want to play it like that? Okay. Yeah, he that he was definitely gonna do something. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't go out there. I don't want Marcus to get killed. Not our boy. And also, I don't want to have to fucking redo this again. The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Oh, shit. Huh, that's not good. Hmm. Oh, shit. Get forward when you hear the signal, you got it? I don't want to tell you to take your time. Come on, let's go, move. Sharing still. I know you're scared, Alice, but you have to trust me. Stay where you are, okay? Whatever happens, don't move. I was gonna try and keep her stressed now. Leave me all alone, Kara. I can't. I can't. Oh, we can create a diversion. Hmm. Free diversion, avoid detection. They just want to chill. They just want to check us. They won't do us any harm. I could help you, Carl. I can attract the guard's attention. Jerry, die for my cause. 
Okay, let's see if we can get. They're going to kill us. I know they're going to kill us. RA9. Back in line, I said. RA9. Ah, oh, shit. Androids are not authorized in return to your line immediately or you will be asked for a few. God damn it, Android or fucking flying fucker. I don't know what else I can do. God damn it. I have no idea what to do. I want to join Alice, of course, but. What's behind these doors? Diversion is over. Oh, I don't have to start over. Oh, fuck. Please, I don't want to have to start over. I oh maybe we're hearing the voices of other people. Are we going to kill us, Carl? Are we going to die? Line up with the others. Right oh now. come on! I was one fucking centimeter off. Come on, game. You gotta give me, cut me some slack. Uh, fuck. Can I restart this section? I'd be fine with restarting car section, but if I have to go back any further, I'm just gonna probably say fuck it <laughs> and then. Line up with the other, right now. God damn, you cannot move. Where's the RA9? What is our other option? Where's like. The RA9? Why doesn't he come and save us? Oh, was my other option that? Fuck me. Okay, I think I have to. Replay Kara section. I can help you, Kara. I can attract the guard's attention. I can help you, Kara. I can attract the guard's attention. Okay. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Okay, so we have to avoid its detection. How does that drone see us every single time? Oh, come on. Are you serious? Okay, I need to play this correctly, I guess. I need to look out for that fucking thing. Where is it? Where the fuck is it? Holy crap, good lord. That, 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 that one took a minute. Okay, in line. Cool. I at least had to get that, of course. We're together, Alice. Nothing can hurt us as long as we have each other. Hmm. Except for this machine. Come on, inside now. We don't really have a choice. That's where we get shot. I 
wonder if we can survive this somehow. Also, they set these up really quickly. Probably for situations like this. Alrighty. Yeah, so this is pretty sad. I'm not usually I'm not a person that usually cries during like movies or scenes like this. But it's still like I can still like kinda feel like the the emotion behind the scenes. Interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants' demonstration by force this time. North! Oh shit, that's not good. Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't see the fucking button prompt. Hold on. Redo. <laughs> Redo. God damn it. Who the f- Why? Why? They, they fucking put a fucking- A prompt as soon as you get out of that cutscene. You're like, okay, you know, I'm watching this cutscene, of course. I'm chilling back. And then all of a sudden, boom, cutscene. Or boom, a fucking- this news Boom, fucking- news live from Action Detroit. sequence. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, okay. despite the fact that the deviants were protesting peacefully. We'll get through this section and then I'll uh, end the, oh, the episode. Because I think this will go on for a while. And if it crosses over, then. Oh, fuck. Hot damn. Oh, damn. Get down, brother. Holy shit, they are. Okay, these bullet prompts are pretty important. Or button prompts. Oh damn, we are really going with this. Ah, oh, fuck. And we're surrounded. That's not good. <sighs> That's not good. Seeing sacrifice. Hmm. I'll just go with the, the obvious, because this is an option. I wonder what the other option is. I wonder if it depends on... like whoa androids can make love oh i mean technically some of them can path unlocked hey let's go let's go there we go baby we got the pacifist option androids kissing as they are about to die has moved the whole country or are they a form of life that we didn't want to acknowledge? Are deviants capable of emotion? And if they feel emotions, must we now consider them as living beings in their own right? 
President Warren is said to have intervened personally to spare the androids. The peaceful demonstration of the deviants and the dignity of Marcus, their leader, has won them sympathy from parts of the population. That is why I have called for the android destruction to be suspended until further notice. I have also ordered a Senate Select Committee to review the facts, establish contact with the deviants, and determine if they can be considered as a new form of intelligent life. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. To tell them that we are people too. Oh Back shit. To a nation. A nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today. Today begins the most challenging moment in Oh shit, it's another one. Because the other one refused. Connor, what are you doing? Obey, that's an order. I... I can't do that. I see. Moral objections. We knew there was a risk you'd be compromised. Which is why we'd always planned on resuming control of your program. Ooh. Resume control? You can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. You needn't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. There's got to be a way. Oh, okay. Find a way out. Okay, so... Go with that. Moral victory. Okay, so yeah. I think I'm going to end things there. It's not there. to judge, but... I'm disappointed at how your story is turning out. Disappointed? Oh, come on. So yeah, I think I'm gonna end things there for now because we just got to that like really huge point and I've been recording for a little bit. But yeah, it looks like next time I just saw a little bit. I think I'm gonna cut to the, just here and looks like we're gonna be going back to Connor because we just got to a big breaking point and now that the androids are presumably gonna have like a relation talks with. Possibly the president of the United States. That'd be pretty interesting to see. So, if you enjoyed the video, uh, make sure to leave a like. That helps me out. Subscribe because I will be uploading more. I'm going to be uploading this along with Smite videos, so don't worry. I have Smite content as well. And with that, until next time, have a good day.